Yes, Alex, how's How it going? Good to see you. Good to see you. And you? Thanks for having me down. No, thanks All for good. having me. How are you? How's it going? I'm very good, thank you. I'm, uh, I'm, in, I'm in a good place at the minute, so I uh, can't complain. It's been a while since I last saw you. It's been a, a period that's been loads of success for the club, but you've had a few injuries. How did you manage that? To be honest, I only had the, the hamstring in this yeah. pre-season in between that time. With me, when, when the game time's down, sometimes people correlate that with an injury. Yeah. When I think over that two-year spell, I've actually... Um, like I said, I only had the hamstring, but I wasn't playing as much. So being fit, available, wanting to play and not playing as much as you like, that's that's obviously more tough as a footballer. Yeah. I see the little one on socials every now and then. Has it changed your approach to being a professional, becoming a father? A little bit, yeah. I think, um, you know, you're, you're doing it for more than just yourself. A big motivation for me is trying to stay at a really good level for as long as possible um, so that he can see me. If not, you have to get the old videos yeah, out. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, obviously my dad did it, but he didn't have me till he was 32. I didn't actually see him too often, so I'm 29 now. Um, he's nearly two, so he should be able to remember me. So it's, it On gives you that little, gives you that little bit of motivation to, to stay at that level. You've been back in the mix, back playing for Liverpool in the Premier League. Have you still got the fire that you had when you were younger? Yeah, definitely. Um, there's a lot of competition for places. So when you do get the opportunities, it makes you that little bit more hungry to make sure you take them. I still feel like there's more in me for sure. One part about your game that I think goes a little bit underrated is the versatility. Is that something you embraced? I think it can go for you and against you. We had a little joke the other day. It was like, what's that show? And today I'm going to be... <laughs> That's, that's Is that how you of, walk out of the changing room? Yeah. I don't know if I'm where I'm going, left, right, midfield, false nine. I'm just happy to play. I'm football focused. We've got a little thing of why I love football. So we'll start off easy. First footballing hero. I'll probably say my dad, because yeah. he was the first one I knew. <laughs> and then, unfortunately for him, he got left for Thierry and Stevie G. Right, next one. Favourite game you've watched? I think the World Cup final just gone. Ah, uh, Were you Team Messi or Mbappe? I was Team Messi. But I love Killian as well. It's just when someone does what they've done their whole career and that was the final thing for him to achieve, I was generally happy for him. Best friend in football? I think I'd definitely say Carl Jenkinson um, from my days at Arsenal. First person I met, we signed at the same time. Up until this day, we speak. Favourite ground to play at? I used to really like Upton Park near West Ham. I always found it difficult there, but I really liked the stadium and the feel of it. Anfield was my least favourite to play at when I wasn't a Liverpool player. Flip reverse, being on, on the home side, I'd say that's probably the most special stadium. When we have those moments, it's like you can't compare that anywhere. Biggest setback of your career? It would be my knee injury there when I did my ACL in 2018. Uh, I think it was six weeks before the World Cup. And yeah, that was a tough one to take because at that point as well, I was, I was one of the the boys that was probably in with a good shout to start mm. for England at the World Cup. I was out for nearly a year with it. When you miss out on those things because of an injury, sometimes you never get it back. Have you got a favourite football memory? To be honest, probably the parade that we did. Sunglasses on. <laughs> yeah, sunglasses fully on. <laughs> How long sagged. did that party last for? It was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> what do you love most about football? Um, I think I've seen every aspect of football. but. At the end of the day, when you get back to playing and getting those rewards back from being part of something that's bigger than, than just you in a team, you realise how special those moments are. Well, Alex, that's why you love football. That is, that was, what guy. was that, bro? You did that and I was thinking, that's a bit official. No, then, I, I might have to cut that. <laughs> He's making me look silly out here. <laughs>